Good morning. It's actually turning out to be a beautiful day. You can see the sun is trying to come out. <laughs> it's actually October 29th. It's the uh, morning after Hurricane Zeta, or Tropical Storm Zeta, moved through last night. And um, I already went through my previous video of Hurricane Zeta, if you want to go back and watch that. Um, <clears throat> This is probably not gonna come out until for at least another couple of more days. But it'll give you an idea of how far in advance I do my videos. At one point I was almost two weeks ahead, but you know, my vacation was pretty long and it just kinda used up all the videos I had made in advance. So I think I'm only about four days out now. But um, today I got a lot of work to do. I need to get out in the garden, I need to I dig up some of my peppers. Um, I may not harvest my watermelon today or my pumpkins, but I'm gonna see. That's even if they're still there. When I walked out there a little while ago, the fence was down. So, probably the wind. But like I said, I'm gonna go out there and uh, dig those peppers up. The temperatures are supposed to drop. Right now, it's uh, I got a high of 67 and beautiful blue skies. But uh, Friday, morning, Saturday morning, Sunday morning. Uh, temperatures are supposed to dip down into the 30s. I don't want frost to kill my plants. So we're gonna dig them up and get them inside the greenhouse. Everything looks good. Until you get down there. I am really thankful I decided to put down these little cages they seem to be working. Maybe it was the wind after all. I don't see any footprints. The mustard seems okay, although they have been nibbled on and I still have kale. These are the three pepper plants that I'm gonna dig up this morning. over here by the turnips and radishes and I'm gonna turn the camera around and show you where the deer have been in here stomping around. And all in here. It's almost like they were dancing in here. So the next thing I'm gonna do is pull up these peppers. It's like they've been chewed on. And that's okay. I still believe they're salvageable. And now for a quick check on the peas. This black meshing is sagging, but it's, it's okay. I'm not going to be able to get in here today, maybe tomorrow, but they look really nice and I see some big peas coming up, so the warm weather has been good for them. Take care of that. And I noticed when I was um, putting the tent stakes in the other day that there are ants all over behind here. So they're going to get some diatomaceous earth too.
I just opened the door to the greenhouse and the heat just blew right in my face. It is really warm in there. Step in and see. It's 90 degrees and muggy. But everything looks good. The poor glass has got all foggy. I had to step out. But this is pretty good. It's um, almost in the 90s. It's uh, nice and warm in there. That makes me very happy. Okay, so I'm gonna put this one in this big planter. Okay, five on the uh, table and one in the cart. Now it's time to transfer them into the greenhouse if I can find some room for them. Oh, and give them some water too. Okay, so I opened the 
door real quick and I came in and I don't know if you can see how warm and muggy it is in here. I can't see my uh, my phone screen, but yeah, it's muggy. It's nice in here. And now I have to rearrange a few things in here so I can get all those peppers in here somewhere. Wow, it filled up really fast. Okay, so I'll put my peppers right here in the corner. I think I may have to move these two on the left over to the right and move my aloe, but we'll see. And so I move these tomatoes. I really need to plant them. In fact, I think I'm gonna go ahead and do that right now. When I say plant them, I mean put them into their new planter. That's what I mean. So I'm gonna do that next. I had basil planted in these and you can still see them. They're there, I did not cover them up, but I'm hoping they'll grow too. Now I need to go find some stakes to stake these up and then I have another plant in there that could use a stake to prop it up. So, oh, I'll be back. All right, so it's uh, about three o'clock and I think I've gotten everything in here done that I wanted to get done today. I still have to fix that, but that's gonna have to be for another day. So I'm gonna go ahead and show you what I've done so far. I moved all the tomatoes down. I have 10 buckets in here. I tied everybody up and I learned to do this pollinating thing that you just tap and tomatoes are self-pollinating, which I didn't know. So I learned that the other day while I was doing YouTube. So as I see flowers, I just give them a little tap and that should help them pollinate better. So that's what I've been doing. All right, I've got, this was the one that was in the corner that was falling down. I got it all tied up. It doesn't look very nice. I'm gonna have to come through and prune it. This one, it was, uh, looked like it was on its way out. So I've got it in a bucket now. It's got fruit on it here. And some flowers, little buds. So I've been tapping those too so I can get some more fruit. Um, there's some fruit down there. And there's all our spices, our herbs, herbs, not spices, all our herbs, some house plants. I've got some extra soil down there. I need to put some stuff on that shelf again for another day. And the peppers here and my poor little aloe plant, which actually looks prettier now that it's been warm in here. Gave it some water and it's turning green. So I think it's gonna thrive in here. We'll have to wait and see. But so far, that's what I've done today for the greenhouse. I have a feeling that I'm going to be doing a lot of work in here <laughs> as it gets cold because it's nice. It really is nice. Let me check the temp. It's still in the 80s. It's nice and humid in here. So if I can keep it warm, I think this is going to work. It's not quite 3 o'clock, but they've been so cooped up because of all the rain, I think I'm gonna go ahead and let them out early today. I think they'll like that. And there they go.
came outside to check on my critters. They're out there digging in the leaves. And uh, it's cold. <sighs> T-shirt shorts at 61. Wind's blowing. It's cold. So I may come out later, put the chickens away, collect some eggs, and that may, may be it for me today. Actually, I thought about going out and cleaning up the garage, but nope, nope, I think I'm done. I'll do that tomorrow in long sleeves, jeans, and some heavier boots. Yeah, that'll be my tomorrow chore, cleaning out the garage. Oh, so I'd appreciate it if you subscribe, like this video, hit the notification bell for notifications when I upload videos, and leave comments. If you have any questions or just want to stop by and say hi, that'd be great. You guys have a great day. Until tomorrow.